Hey guys, I'm Myra. You might know me from Low Carb Love. But today we're going to be doing something a little different. We're doing my morning routine. Just wanting to share a little more about my life and show you some behind the scenes outside of cooking. to my trainer Cora so this is where I'm at she kicks my butt she's like my little drill sergeant okay but um, I want you guys to go in the comments and guess her age I'm not gonna oh, disclose boy. her age okay? I'm not disclosing it you would be mind blown at her age she's amazing so anyway um, yeah I'm in here what three to four four days a week it's just been super, super helpful. If you follow me on Instagram, then you know I talk about it. If you don't follow me on Instagram, go do that right now. Um, I share a lot about my journey. Working out, I actually took about a two year break. So Cora has been helping me stay super consistent, staying in here. I know you probably hear about this online, but it can do so much for your mental health. And I don't like to throw that word around too much, but it really has made a world of a difference for me. So if you're not utilizing the gym, I would highly suggest it because not only are you gonna get in shape, feel better about yourself, your confidence, all of that, um, it really just helps keep you kind of like, I don't know, I don't know how to explain it. Overall, it makes me feel so much better about myself. So anyway, I'm not gonna get too much into that. I just wanted to share that with you guys. But um, yeah, today we're doing an all, what is it, a whole body? Whole body like a whole body whole workout, body. a little bit of booty, a little bit of legs, some arms. So I'm just gonna kind of bring you along so you can see what I do in here. Let's go. Woo, let's go. So we are gonna make our coffee. I usually do either iced or hot. I'm in the mood for iced. Put a bunch of ice. This is my recipe, okay? I'm gonna show you how I make my magical cafecito. So I used to use the Starbucks unsweetened blonde espresso. Have no clue in the world what happened to it, but now they only make the medium, which second best, so. And we have some unsweetened creamer. Okay, and finish it off with pumpkin spice. This is the non-dairy, so just a little splash and a dash of cinnamon. Everything in life, guys, everything in life. Hey guys, so I just dropped off Nappy, showered, I'm in a robe. I love doing my makeup in a robe. So I'm gonna do a very quick look um, to get ready. I am gonna do a little bit of filming today. So comment down below, let me know which recipes you'd love to see. But right now, I'm just going to finish up. I'm gonna show you some of the things that have saved my life with makeup. I absolutely love them. These are actually some of the dupes to really expensive um like this is a bb cream from maybelline i think it's like maybe nine less than ten dollars and it's better than the nars bb cream really just kind of it's not so much coverage i just love the um i feel like it like evens out my skin tone bring it down into the neck so this is the blush baby the blush baby is so perfect just to give you like that rosy look you know the kind of like effortless i'm not wearing makeup look Love it, obsessed. We have the Foolproof Brows by Benefit. These are everything, guys. They make my brows look like nice and bushy. I love that natural look, okay? And for the eyebrow gel, I have been obsessed with the one from Benefit for so many years, but I just recently found the one from NYX. So look at this. So this one here is the one from Benefit. Absolutely love it. I've been using this for years. And this costs about $28 or so. So almost $30 for this little guy. I found this at Target the other day because I read, I saw it, I think, on TikTok. And this is the one from NYX. It's the brow glue. And I've been using it instead of my other benefit. And then I'll just go back and kind of calm them down because it kind of gives you that laminated look. This will literally keep my brows in place all day. I'm just going to go in with a gloss. This is uh, by Maybelline and it is Color Moon. I feel like gloss is necessary right now in the winter time because lips get so chapped. You know? Finish it off 
with my all-time favorite, this little bad boy. Keeps my makeup set all day. Like, literally my makeup will still look the same once I'm done filming. So that is a super quick makeup look. Um, I feel like it's enough makeup, but it's like not too heavy. And if I'm a little shiny, then I'll just go in with some setting powder. And it still actually keeps my makeup set all day. Let me show you what I do with my hair. Um, I have my, I already threw in a little dry shampoo. So I do dry shampoo. This brush from Revlon. Guys, I'm going to leave this linked in the description below because if you don't have one of these to blow dry your hair, it is like an essential. I do, I can't, cannot live without this. This is actually perfect for when your hair is super wet. Like it's made to dry out your hair when it's like soaking wet or not soaking wet, but wet. Um, but I also love it like when I throw my dry shampoo in and then just kind of run it through my hair. You know, it makes it look really fluffy. <laughs> Okay, and it usually takes me, um, if my hair is actually wet, it'll take me about 10, 15 minutes to blow dry. But if not, I just run it through my hair and in one minute, I feel like it just looks bouncy, you know? Like it makes my hair just look really bouncy and clean. All right guys, so that is pretty much my morning routine. I get up, go to the gym, take my daughter to school, grab some cafecito, and put myself together for a full day of work. The most important thing that I would share with you guys is keeping to your routine. A lot of times, I don't feel like we give it the importance that it deserves. A lot of you are usually like, oh my gosh, Myra, how do you stay so motivated? How do you stay so consistent? And the truth is that it all falls back on my routine. There's so many days where I wake up and I'm like, not motivated i'm like the last thing i want to do right now is go to the gym but i make it happen because it's part of my routine so you know like everything is just like uh 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 so i would say that um that's probably one of the most important things that i could like if you ask for my tip in terms of like how i stay motivated and how i stay on track it is sticking to my routine so I hope it's helpful. I hope it's something that you guys can implement in your life. Comment down below. Let me know what has helped you on your routine, like to really stay consistent and be successful in whatever it is that you do, because sometimes that can be super helpful to others. But guys, I hope you really enjoyed this video. I really just want to start sharing a little more about my life and like what I do outside of cooking. So I hope you guys really enjoyed that. Thanks so much for being here. If you haven't subscribed to the channel, make sure you go do that to see more videos like this. Like I guess a glimpse into my life. But thanks so much for being here, guys. I love you, and I'll see you on the next video. Mwah.